Hello, and welcome to a brief description of the Geology 135 classes we offer at Northern Virginia Community College. Um, the way these classes work is that before the day of the trip, the students are responsible for reading through a selection of materials that are placed online at the course website by the instructor. So in the case of my classes, this means that you go to the website and you read the pre-trip readings and you also take a look at the logistics page which talks about the sort of uh, stuff you can expect on the day of the trip, how you need to dress, what you need to bring, um, and that kind of business. Then on the day of the trip, students have to show up at the appointed time um, to meet up with the class. Uh, generally our transport is in a series of Nova vehicles, but we also um, may need to use some student vehicles, so we'll have carpools and student vehicles. In general, the number of vehicles needs to be kept to an absolute minimum, and the reason for that is that many of the areas where we go on these geology field trips have very limited parking, and um, sometimes, you know, for instance, on uh, my Massanutten trip, if there's more than two vehicles, there are certain stops that we just can't go to. Um, so that's the way that works. Uh, then on the day of the trip itself, uh, the instructor brings the students around to a series of field locations and at those field locations the students uh, complete a series of uh, studies of the rocks, uh, figuring out how those rocks formed and what they mean. Later, um, after the field trip itself is over, in the ensuing two weeks the students are responsible for synthesizing the information that they learned on the field trip. So this includes observations of rock types and rock structures and then also geological interpretations of those rock types and rock structures. And the goal here is to come up with a story, come up with a, a history of these rocks over time, um, how geologic conditions have changed at that particular location, and um, tell the story of the area uh, as recorded in the rocks. The result is a paper, and that paper is around three to five pages in length. Um, for most of the locations we go to, it'll be difficult to uh, cram it all into three pages. Five pages, I think, is a more realistic expectation. Um, and that assumes uh, some level of brevity on the part of the student, rather concise, uh, to the point writing, no extra fluff, um, and uh, just cutting to the chase. So then that paper is submitted uh, online via an email attachment, the instructor grades it, and then the student grade is uh, entered. So if you have any questions about how these classes run, I encourage you to contact the instructor. What I've just described applies to my classes, Cal and Bentley and you can contact me at cbentley at nvcc.edu or give me a call in my office at 703-323-3276.